Ah, what a beautiful Thursday morning. Hey, welcome back to it. Your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso live on SABC3. You gorgeous people. Just in time for some TikTok this morning. And uh, listen, if you're thinking of taking a gap year or are working, you know, part-time, it's a good idea to put some time aside to learn a new skill as a way of gaining some focus during these precarious times, okay? What a word, what a word. Now, with that in mind, Grant Hines joins us to talk about uh, the five apps that are really transforming the way that we do business, that are going to help you, uh, you know, have the time, uh, could help you improve or help you with something to add onto your CV, help add skills for a new job, or even unlock a new creative passion. It's exciting. Saying the word precarious, precarious. is precarious for you. Precarious, right? I don't, I, don't, I don't use that word a lot. I think this is probably the first time ever in ever. my life I've used that word. That's something to add on to my CV now, to say I know how to pronounce a variety precarious. of words such as precarious. I think uh, hosting espresso is probably like top of the list there. But I'm really excited about this one because yeah. we did a, a bunch of apps that can help you get jobs and get work, remember? Like yeah. A couple yeah. of weeks ago. And that was probably one of the most popular uh, inserts that we've done Yes. Um, on Expresso recently. Mm. And I think this is going to be one of those. So stay tuned. Whatever you're doing, just g give us five minutes and we'll help you out here. Mm -hmm. uh, there's a bunch of apps that can really improve your capacity to get work, number oh. one, and upskill yourself. A lot of people are taking gap years. Mm. Some mm. people are out of employment. Mm. Like it's like COVID has really, uh, you know, done us a bad one. Mm. But Grab a mic, my oh, friend. Oh, there we go. Okay. Mm. But uh, bec what we can do is we can uh, start the opportunity to upskill ourselves. South Africans are always positive. Yes. We always see the positive outlook, and I mm. think this is a great way to start doing it's that. What I'm loving is the fact that you can do it from the comfort of your home. Yes. Everything has become such a dig digital space where you can literally learn something new, technology, everything comes from either an app or your phone. And this is now where the causes can come in to take us to some of those five apps. Okay, so probably the best one and the most important one is yeah. one called Mimo. M-I-M-O. Mimo. Mimo. Yeah. Okay. So it's an app that helps you learn how to code. What? Coding, yeah, coding is really, uh, it's, it's one of those things that people think is so hard to do. Yes. It's so uh, overcomable. I, I should have done it when I was in school. Yeah. It's a language that's really hard. Kids are learning to code now because all these job opera these job offerings and openings now require you to do, do to develop code or develop with code. Um, and kids are taking those jobs. And I think a lot of us who are a little bit older feel like, oh, we missed the boat on this one, yeah. but you haven't. So if you've got time on your hands, download Mimo mm. and start learning how to develop. It will open up so many opportunities for you in the workplace. And those are very high paying jobs as well. Yes. But it, give it a couple of months and invest some time, mm. get good at it. Uh, find like internship at places which are prepared to train you with yeah. the knowledge that mm. you ex currently have mm. and then you should see yourself excel but make a plan and Amimo is a great place to start fantastic what's the second one second one is Skillshare Skillshare is really popular it is uh, a monthly sub okay. uh, so you pay a monthly fee and then you have access to uh, all, a whole variety of different skills. Some of them are ones that are traditional skills and some of them are kind of lateral, like how to think creatively mm. as a course or how to f direct a film or how to edit a YouTube video mm. and you pay a uh, once-off fee for that. So go have a look at Skillshare and see if there's anything that uh, like rings your so bell. There's a range of and, courses depending on your interests. And just to mention, monthly sub means monthly subscription for everybody. That's yes, yeah. So you have to pay a monthly subscription. That's why it's, 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 it's not necessarily the best option. But they're but, not the most expensive of subscriptions. No, it's either. not a university, it's not a university fee, which yeah. is great. Coursera is the third one. I love that. Okay, Coursera, you have to pay per course. Mm. So you can go through the courses. Some of them are free, yeah. which is great. So you can actually try out a couple of courses. Mm. So that's spelled C O U R uh, S E R A. And then you can learn a couple of different skills um, that you want to learn. And then if you can afford to get a course and get like paper behind that course through yeah. Coursera. Well, some people, in fact, I use Coursera myself. And what I found is that, ah. even, yes, I have been on Coursera quite you, a number of what times. What did you do? Absolutely, yes. So what I've been doing is um, last year I had registered with the University of Cape Town's Graduates Business School of uh, yeah. uh, well, Graduate uh, yeah, School yeah, yeah. of Business. And now I'm looking to do a master's in marketing, but without being able to travel the world, you kind of mm. are stuck at home. You can even find master's programs wow. uh, on Coursera. You can That's go on there and find some uh, really advanced courses as well. So there's a range from the skilling course to 
the sort of upgraded postgraduate course. And then lastly, I think we should mention the one that's free. It's called Khan Academy. Mm. And Khan Academy is what they consider like the, the it's it's an open source nonprofit uh, digital learning place. Mm. So you can learn so many different courses that are available for free online and just upskill yourself. If you need to learn how to write a CV or mm. you need to learn how to uh, do like a, a professional trade, mm. you can learn it through Khan Academy. Wow. Um, and it's completely free uh, for you to do that, which is also really cool. That is incredible. It looks like there's something for everyone with uh, the, these courses that you've sort of put forward here, whether it's for the kids and really just trying to get them to do something interesting and to improve at maths or whatever it is that they're trying to do, or whether it's for someone who is really just trying to look at how they climb up the corporate ladder, as it were, at home and look at how do I add a skill so that I'm able to get that promotion or to be employable. Yeah, absolutely. Of mm. course, let us know what you thought of these apps brought to you by Grant Hines, Expresso Morning Show, SABC3. You rock.